10 Facts About Spoon Bills Fact number 10, Spoonbill lives near wet area. Spoonbills live in wetlands, estuaries, saltwater bayous, and lakes preferring shallow waters for feeding. Fact number 9, they are related to the ibis. The African Spoonbill is related to the ibis. They belong to the Thriscornithidae family along with the ibis. Their Latin name is Platyli alba which, literally translated, means pearl water bird. Fact number 8, Spoonbills love seafood. Did we already mention how they are built for the water? Their long legs make wading in and moving through water pretty easy. They fish in the shallow waters of inland rivers, lakes, marshes and stream where they tend to settle. Fact number 7, they can live 15 years, or more. Spoonbills have a pretty long lifespan. In the wild they can live as long as 15 years. In captivity, their lives can extend to an average of 17 years. Fact number 6, they use their spoon-shaped bills to snap up their prey. They use their spoon-shaped bills to catch their prey. Their bills are relatively wide and flat, with a wider circular shape at the bottom of their bill. This spoon shape only develops once the chick has broken free of their egg, they're actually born with straight bills. Fact number 5, the spoon bill is the size of a 3-year-old human. The average African spoon bill is approximately the size of a toddler, which is pretty big for a bird. They stand approximately 3 feet tall with an incredible wingspan of between 4 and 4 and a half feet in length. Fact number 4, they're social butterflies. Roseate spoonbills would be extroverted if they were human, they love spending time with each other and even with other types of wading birds such as cormorants, herons, storks, and egrets. In fact, it's rare to see them alone, they nest in colonies and fly in flocks. Fact number 3, their wingspan is almost double their height. While the biggest difference between flamingos and spoonbills is their beak shape, spoonbills are also significantly shorter than them. While flamingos average a height of 1.25 meters, just over 4, roseate spoonbills only usually reach a height of about 80 centimeters, around 2 apostrophe 6. Fact number 2, they are shy. Spoonbills are introverts. They are pretty shy and prefer to associate with their own kind. If a human gets too close, they will fly away. Fact number 1, they are good parents with stable families. 3 to 5 eggs are laid in the nests of the spoonbills during mating season. The mating season is just before or during the rainy season, with eggs usually being laid in April or May. Breeding pairs will settle in communities with as many as 250 other breeding pairs. These nests are built in trees, reed beds, islands and rocky ledges. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.